In this video, we show you how to install the IoT Cloud Server solution on your own local computer. You may want to do a test installation on your own computer before committing to a virtual private server service. We will be using the same Cloud Server installation script for installing on a local computer. Note that the installation script is designed for Linux, but we use a Windows 10 computer and the Windows subsystem for Linux. You may of course use this tutorial for installing the IoT solution on a standard Linux desktop distribution. The installation script installs the IoT SMQ broker example and the LED examples JavaScript powered single page web application. Notice there's no device client connected message we get when we initially navigate to the LED examples JavaScript powered single page application. The installation script also installs the LSP Application Manager, which is an IDE that enables development using a browser. We can easily connect a client by downloading the SMQ example C code and compiling this code. The SMQ C code is hosted on GitHub. The easiest way to download this code from GitHub is to use the git command line client. The Windows subsystem for Linux does not have this command by default, so we must install it. We must also install make and gcc. Make and gcc are used when compiling the SMQ example C code. We can compile the code as soon as all tools have been installed and when SMQ has been downloaded from GitHub. The SMQ client example can be run as soon as it has been compiled. The example by default connects to Realtime Logic's online test broker. You may either modify the C source code and set the SMQ broker URL to your own computer, or you may specify the URL on the command line when starting the example. The SMQ client example should connect to your local SMQ broker as soon as it starts. The connected client then shows up in the LED examples web application. You may set the LEDs using the single page web application or by using the SMQ example client running on the command line. The SMQ client is immediately removed from the web application when we terminate the SMQ client example by entering control C. This was a short introduction to how you can run the IoT solution on your own computer. For more details, refer to the written tutorial.